Okay, here we are at day in the park in Amstelveen, Amsterdam. I'm, I'm here just fresh from the main stage. This is Housequake. Hello. Hi there. Hi, hi. I'm, I'm, I'm over here. <laughs> Fantastic. How was it for you guys uh, headlining the main stage just now in the rain? How was it? Well, you just scooped it. It, it was raining like hell after 10 minutes or so. And the first time when it broke loose, it was the people were like, yeah, okay, funny. <laughs> But after the third time, they were like, mm, we don't like it. But uh, to, uh, to our is, point of view from upstairs. But the thing is, we were looking, we were so much looking out for this one. You know, it's like, this is our favorite festival to do. Yeah, that's true. And we moved on, you know, we moved up from like... The starting warm, set. Warming up, <laughs> we promoted. <laughs> and now we have this weather. <laughs> uh, it's, it's horrible. But I mean... Amsterdam, still there, but still there. Yes, I mean, Amsterdam showed us love. Yeah. Did you guys adjust your set in any way because of the rain? We kept it dark. <laughs> you kept it wet. Yes. Okay. Now, Housequake obviously started a few years ago. Maybe you should let the uh, the, the viewers to this uh, 365 Mag uh, broadcast let them know how did Housequake actually start? Because it started with an accident. Is that correct? Kind of. Yeah. There's much debate about that one because. Um, we're not agreeing on this subject. Well, my, my opinion is that, my, my story is that um, he was late. And because he was late, our, I already started playing some tracks. And then he bumped in and it was like, well, okay, let's do this back to back. Nowadays, you know, everybody and, uh, playing back to back in some house, some way, somewhere. But when we started this six years ago or something, like this, six years ago? Seven, eight, I don't know. It, 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 like, like an accident, we, we, we're going to do this. And the crowd was packed, it was, uh, the place was packed, and it was amazing. And uh, people were really reacting like, that's nice. They're playing together, and we were, you know, fucking up each other with, with tracks and, and stuff. So the, after that, we said we have to do this more often. Yeah. But um, I'm agreeing on this, except for one thing. <laughs> He was not he late. I was early. <laughs> I wasn't late. He was late. He was late. Okay. That's not possible. I'm never because, late. Because he always started before me. So he just blew himself. This whole story is... Objection. End of Objection. Story. Objection. <laughs> well, of course, Housequake uh, is, is absolutely booming this year. And this is not the first major festival you've played this year. You've, you've, done a, you've done a few big ones, including your own festival, Housequake Festival, right? Yeah, uh, we always in the beginning of the of the season. So, yeah, the spring season actually, not not even summer. We do our own festival in May, and um, thank God for the last three years we have beautiful weather, yeah. no rain at all. Yes, really. this was the 22nd of May. May I remind you? And it was beautiful weather. And now we're in the midst of the summer, and it's fucking raining. But I have news yeah. for you. I probably here in Amsterdam somewhere, end September it's going to be really good weather again until then not an option you don't look convinced. now you guys obviously are very successful in your own right eric you're always playing every weekend all over the netherlands rogue you're doing the same you just come back from miami you, you guys got ibiza you're very very busy how how do you get time to 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 actually fit the housequake uh project into your schedule because you're both very busy un, under your own steam you know well, in, the, in the beginning of the year we we get together and um we're kind of decide what we want to do for this year. Housequake is, is like an exclusive thing. We, we do it maybe six times a year. Our own festival, one time in Rotterdam, one time in Den Haag, uh, on productions. Two or maybe three um, festivals, yeah. festivals from other uh, organizations. And that's it, final point. So yeah. it's already decided in January. Isn't it? Yeah. 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 Now you guys also, I think a month ago, did the festival where you played, I think, about 10, 11 hours together. How the hell do you guys prepare for that? That's a huge project, isn't it? Yeah, we, uh, it was horrible. <laughs> I was so nervous for this one, uh, but it turned out okay because it's our own festival. And I know it, it just it felt natural. I don't know. It, it just We just started and people were really feeling it. Yeah, it, it has to be said that uh, because of um, a really, really good sound system, yeah. we were able to pull it through for 10 hours, 11 hours, yeah. it, does, it didn't matter anymore. It, it could no, stay on until people, 16 hours. The because people gave we, us we, so we, much love. It's true, but, but, but it, the beginning of everything is you have to get to the people with the sound, with the bass and stuff. And when there is not a proper sound system, 
we're fucked. You know, I, I, I can stand in my, my underpants and, and wave at the people. I'm fucked. If we have good sound, we can work with it. You know, I did the whole warm-up thing. A rogue popped in and, and, and put it up a notch. And after that, we, we did for four hours or five hours the, the, the three of us, the, the housequake thing. Yeah. And it was an amazing day. Yes, they, they really had to convince me for this one because I, I was so afraid to do it. But it was it turned out more than okay. Yeah. Well, you guys, I noticed that you also incorporate DVDs into your sets. How does it all work technically? Are you doing back to back or it's one of you throwing the DVD loops? How, how does it all come together in the booth? You want to reveal the, the whole thing? No, or? it's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> It's the housequake secret. Nah, come on. No, it's, no. It's, it's technical, pretty difficult because no one else is doing it, or well, I don't. Not a lot of people. Got kind of a thing. Going yes, as well. but it's different. Yeah. But, yes, but it's it's different. So it, it's it's a pretty difficult technical thing, and um, well, I cannot say more well, no, about well, it. In, in the bit, we're fijing ourselves. Yeah. That's the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. When, when he starts in a, an a cappella, running from a DVD player. Which we mix in like audio. Yeah. We also put in the, the with the, with the AD roll. We yeah. put in uh, the visuals as well. Yeah. So that's the secret. We're playing and we're doing. Visuals. We're mixing in DVDs yeah. with acapellas on it, with looping and stuff and, 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 and chorus stuff. and lines yeah. and stuff. But it's it's cool because it's we always try to bring it up a notch. You know, we, we it's 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 always a challenge for us. Yeah. And just finally, do you guys actually get a chance to get in the studio? Because I believe you had a Housequake production out earlier this year, is that correct? Maybe you can tell the, uh, the viewers a little bit about your studio plans together, if there are any. We don't have any studio plans. No, not at the moment. No, we just released a track and it's... Uh, We're doing only one track a year. Yeah, because, of the, because of the festival. Yeah. Yeah. No, the thing is, everyone, the whole trend is put out so much stuff as possible. And we're always doing things and in an opposite way, you know? We only do like five or six gigs a year. We only do one track a year, we keep it exclusive. Sounds good, I'll ask you guys one more question. I'll just bring in the MC. We have a good look at MC here. Mr. MC, who are you and how is your role with Housequake? Well, um, I'm like the, the hype man, I'm the preacher. I'm the, um, I'm the MC. I talk to the people. I, um, I sing with the people. Uh, the thing is, like the sum up housequake biceps to the people. The thing is, the thing is, um, apparently, like what I find is like these guys are being really shy. The thing is, like housequake is like you got the best two uh, guys from Holland who've got years and years of experience. Out of hand now he's no, getting no, out of hand. Now listen to this, it's true. You've got years and years of experience. You combine them both. You combine them both in a set with two guys. The one being black, the one being white, as in the yin yin the yang. Combining combining as one with an MC, you who have this guy? Who this guy? which is the yin and which is the yang. That's what this this is true, this is true. At the end you have a, a complete set that doesn't compare to anything you've ever heard before. And Housequake is ready for the world, is ready for everything, and has been rocking Holland for years and years. It is my pleasure, it is really, I'm, I'm, I'm saying this, I'm speaking from the heart. It is my pleasure and my joy to be a part of this duo, trio. And the thing is, no, I'm, I'm, I'm for real, I'm speaking for real. The thing is, the music, the, the music, the music just takes you higher and take you higher. And when it, when it comes together at a gig like this, a day at the park, um, it doesn't matter if they shift left or they shift right, they go deep, they go high. The music just keeps on rolling, keeps on rolling, and that's all the talking that, that needs to be done. I think you put it very, I couldn't have put it better myself. Fantastic. Okay. Okay, just very finally, what is the future of Housequake in a couple of words? We're retiring in a year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to live on Ibiza and uh, there I'll uh, say goodbye to them all. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They don't know it yet, but they're going to take over the world. They're just being shy. They're, they're just being shy. Housequake, thank you very much. Great stuff. Thank you, Rakir. Thanks, guys.